As a lightning storms travel across the first coast, we're on your side this evening with information on how you can protect your home and what to do if your property is struck by lightning. Atia Collins spoke with a structural engineer and Atia, uh, you learned about the best material for a roof that could actually prevent a lightning strike from becoming a fire. That's right. I had the chance to speak with one structural engineer who tells me that metal roofs could prevent your home from catching on fire if lightning was to strike. But this is not 100% foul proof. There are no ways to prevent lightning from hitting your home. And that's why I'm on your side with methods you can take right now to make sure you and your property are safe. Florida is the lightning capital of the United States, averaging up to 100 thunderstorm days per year in some areas of the state, according to the National Weather Service. This leaves homes and buildings at risk of destruction. For a direct hit, it can cause a fire and most likely will cause a fire. Uh, the other thing is that it creates a power surge. This video from 2022 shows lightning hitting a home in Fernandina Beach, leaving a hole in the roof and damaging the electrical system, according to the homeowner. Luckily, the house did not go up in flames. Ron Woods is a structural engineer and says construction materials could be the difference between a lightning strike and a lightning initiated fire. You know, metal panels on the roof, those tend to spread the, the lightning strike strike out quite a bit rather than where where you have shingles or some other type of flexible um, asphaltic roof system on there then uh, the, the lightning just goes right into that. Besides replacing your roof, homeowners can also install lightning rods, which are designed to intercept a lightning strike. While this will help, Woods says it will not prevent lightning from hitting your home, and insurance agents urge homeowners to look at their policy now to ensure coverage. Don't go to your electrical panel and start messing with it. Leave all of that alone and um, maybe just take pictures of what you can see that was damaged. Some other tips from the National Weather Service inside a building is the safest place to be during a lightning storm, but they warn that you should not be touching any electrical outlets or any appliances that may conduct the electricity if lightning was to strike your home. Reporting in Jacksonville, Tia Collins, First Coast News on your side.